Hello, this is Nicole. Welcome, my genie. Sims and wishes here to give you hugs and kisses. Like, comment, subscribe, watch channel, come alive. And make sure to hit the notification bell to get notified every time I upload. Thank you, and I messed up my intro. Yay! And today's Curtison video is going up a day early, but don't worry, I have a Monday Curtison plan. Today's Curtison is a Mother's Day Curtison, so happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Anyways, I have a single mom and two children. This is Diana Meadows. She has a son that's a child named Kevin and a little toddler named Jenny. Diana's aspiration is super parent. Her traits are family-oriented, cheerful, and a goofball. And Kevin's aspiration is social butterfly, and he is outgoing. And Jenny's trait is angelic, and I'm sure Clint, and you let me know in the comments on who your favorite sim is. Whenever it gets to that part, whenever you see all the rest of them. So Clem has a story for them, so take it away, Clem! Yay! Clemmy, Clemmy, Clemmy. Well, you see, Diana is now a single parent. Because her husband, Brian, which is another common name... <laughs> yeah, I didn't pick these folks, as you can tell. He is missing in action. He's in the military, and they were having a really bad war in Strangeville, and they can't find him anywhere. He's presumed dead, but they don't know for sure. So, Diana, common name, is having a lot of issues. But you shake your fist at me, young lady. Because she has to raise now two children on her own. And unless Brian decides to be found. Which they're looking for him, but they haven't found him. It's been like two years. They think the damn plant ate him, they're not for sure. Uh, it ate Ed before, it spit him out though, because he tasted like damn nasty pork. What can I tell you? It did not. Shut up, Ed. I'm kind of sorry. <laughs> Anyway, both the kids are really great kids. They've had a great upbringing. Um, the little one practically walks around with a little halo on her head. That's a little Jenny. Jenny, Jenny, Jenny. And Kevin's just a normal little boy, but he's a really good kid too. They listen to their mom. They do what they, she asked them to do. Well, they can't get a little rambunctious kids can, you know. That's what they're saying. They never do things they're not supposed to do. Sometimes they do. But they're all around just good children. And Diana keeps hoping every night that Brian will come back to her and the kids because they really miss him terribly. And he barely even knows the baby. She was actually just a newborn whenever he was missing. All he saw was little baby pictures. He wasn't even there when she was born. Which is really sad if you ask me. Uh, Diana's thinking about hiring um, a private investigator to look for him too, so let's see if a Let's Play starts with this, this, these folks. I think I'll definitely have to do that now. Thank you, Clem. You're welcome. Are you done with their story? For now. <laughs> yeah, I'll continue on from there. Maybe Brian's alive, maybe he's not. All of you will find out. I will, I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do with their Let's Play. Maybe soon. My schedule's full right now because I have I have the Watchful Rider with Bryn. That's still kind of new. And I have the Alphabet Baby Challenge. That's new. It just came out Saturday. So <clears throat> we'll have to wait and see what happens. I have Sunday and Thursday off normally. But whenever, whenever I have special videos, I want to share with all of you. And that is one of them because, you know, it's Mother's Day. Very special. Mother's Day is very, very special to me because I have my <laughs> mom, of course. And I plan on doing a Father's Day criticism, you know, just like the Mother's Day one, whenever Father's Day does hit next month. So I'll be doing that then. Yeah. And I don't, I don't know. 
Whenever, whenever schedule clears up, I'll figure out a title for this Let's Play. That will be the next one I'll do. I promise all of you I will do that. I have no title for it. I'm very prepared. <laughs> and well, should I stay or just wait? Let's wait. Alright. I'll do that Let's Play next whenever my schedule clears up in the future. And here you see Kevin. Kevin likes to wear green. His hair color is green, so. Oh, I thought it was yellow like the minions. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin. Kevin, no, so he looks like um the dude from Stuart Little. Yeah, my sister oh, Angel. What was his name? George. George. He looks like George. Yeah, yeah. What was his name, Kevin? Yeah, my sister Angel thinks that Kevin looks like George from Stuart Little. And here you see little Jenny. She's adorable. I can't wait to do this Let's Play whenever I have the chance. Let me know in the comments if you would be interested in seeing it. And if you're interested in seeing the story continue. I'm really excited for it. And whenever I have the chance, I'll do it. I don't know who my favorite Sim is. I love them all the same. So if you love them all the same too, then that's perfectly fine with me. And... If you have a favorite sim, that's fine with me too. I'm good with anything, to be honest. <clears throat> but I guess if I have to choose one, I don't know. I guess it would have to be Diana. And then we're getting close to the end of the video anyway. So anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you found this heartwarming. Jump into the gene lap in here. I was welcome. I love you all so much. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, everybody. Goodbye, everyone. It is.